I was told that crying makes me weak, but I beg to differ. Because I cry, that doesn't mean that there is a weakness inside of the integrity that I possess. Crying is a natural language that the Lord has created. It is there for my release. It is there for me to acknowledge that the situation that I have now encountered, I have come to fully terms with it. I have come to grips with it. And I know that crying doesn't mean that I'm weak. It means that I'm strong. I know this. Because Jesus himself wept when his best friend Lazarus died. And I know that Jesus was in no shape or form weak. Neither was he powerless. He was strong then. He is strong now. And he's always been the epitome of strength. Because I'm crying, it does not mean that I am weak. It doesn't reflect that I am weak because I am crying. It does not mean that God has not got this situation in control. I cry because tears are a language and God understands. There are times that I can't speak because I have no words to portray what I'm feeling, therefore I groan. And because I do this, I know that God knows what I'm saying. When I groan, the Spirit make it intercession for me. It's a form of release when I cry. I cry because it's a form of release. Because tears are a language and God understands. I know that I am strong even when I cry. I know that God is hearing me even when I can't utter a word. So I cry because I'm cool doing it. I cry because it's a release doing it. I'm crying because I'm all right doing it. I'm not weak, I am strong when I cry. <sighs>